Hey guys, so today I want to do a review on my HG foundation. If you guys watch my March favorites video, you will see that I raved about this foundation. I said it's my HG foundation and I am totally obsessed and in love with it. And the foundation that I was talking about was the Lancome Tint Adult 24 Hour Makeup. And I love this foundation. I have had this since uh, I think January. And like I said in my March favorites, I have been using it ever since. If you are a makeup lover like me, you definitely need to go out and buy this foundation. It is worth every freaking penny. I'm going to do a demo for you guys and I'm going to wear it for at least eight hours. And I'm going to come back and I'm going to do a review. And I'm just going to give you my thoughts on why you guys should go out and buy this foundation. So if you want to see the demo and review, please stay tuned. Okay, so first I'm going to just start out with my Benefit Professional Primer. And I just have a sample of this. So I'm going to just take a little bit of that. I'm just going to put it right here. And I love using the Benefit Professional Primer because I do have enlarged pores right here. So this helps with um, closing up my pores and making my skin just look a little bit more smoother. Next, I'm going to take the Lancome. I'm going to squirt like two pumps. Then I'm going to take my Real Techniques brush. You can get this brush at CVS, Walmart, Walgreens. It's like $7. And I recommend using this type of brush with this foundation simply because if you use a beauty blender, it may not give you a uh, full coverage. I recommend using a beauty blender when you're using like a heavy foundation such as MAC Studio Fix Fluid. If you're using a lighter foundation such as this or let's just say the NARS uh, Luminous Foundation, you want to use a brush. You will get more product by using a brush and I really recommend using the Real Techniques brush because it's very affordable. Anyway, I'm going to take my foundation stipple it on and I just do a little at a time I'm not I don't like to overdo my foundation so I'm just gonna take a little bit Now, one pump is going to give you light to medium coverage. Two pumps is going to give you medium to full coverage. I just want to blend that out. Next, I'm just going to take my favorite concealer, which is the MAC Pro Longwear Concealer. I'm just going to take a little bit of that. Take about that much. I'm going to take my MAC Raisin Blush. All right. Take some more lipstick, which is the Maybelline Crazy for Coffee. I already did my eyeshadow and my um, eyelashes off camera. So then I'm just going to take my Urban Decay 
And I'm just going to set this foundation. All right. And as you can see, it gives you such a beautiful coverage. I don't know if you guys can see that, but if you guys can see, it gives you such it gives you such a beautiful coverage. It gives you such a beautiful coverage and it covers up everything. It covered up most of my hyperpigmentation. It evened out my skin. And it also gives me such a natural look. I love a foundation that can cover up my hyperpigmentation and give me a natural look. It is now 5.04. I'm gonna come back, I'm gonna show you guys how it held up for eight hours and how it controlled my oil after eight hours of wear. Hey guys, so I'm back after six hours of wearing the Lancome Tint Adol Foundation. I'm back to do my full review. If you guys can see, the foundation is still on my skin after six hours of wear. I'm just going to show you guys. So, the foundation is still on my skin. I am a little bit shiny. Um, in the mirror, I don't really look shiny, but... Um, in the camera, I don't know why I look a little bit more shinier than I do in person, but I do not look really bad. I look still pretty flawless for someone who has had foundation on for six hours and I am loving it. I blotted, I would say, um, within five hours of wearing this foundation, I did blot. It wasn't really necessary, but I did still blot just because I do not like to build up oil. So I blotted one time throughout six hours, and this is how I look after just one time of blotting and six hours of me wearing the foundation. I think I look pretty damn good. My foundation is still on my skin. My blush is still there. I still look like I can pretty much go out anywhere if I had to go somewhere tonight. I can pretty much go out just like this. So with that being said, this is one reason why I love the foundation. After six hours, you still have a flawless look. Another thing I love about this is the fact that it controls my oil. I can get very, very oily throughout the day. And this does a great job of controlling my oil like i said before i only blotted one time and it's been six hours and i only blotted one time so that to me is pretty good because most foundations i have to blot maybe three or four times throughout the day another thing that i love about this is that it stays on the skin all day long like i said before my foundation is still on my skin. I can still go anywhere like this. And it is 11.31 at night. Another thing I love about this foundation is that it gives you such a natural, beautiful look on your skin. You look flawless, literally flawless. Like, I don't have clear skin. I do not have clear skin at all. But every time I wear this, I look like I have clear skin. I look like like I have the perfect skin. Like I have no hyperpigmentation. I have no pimples. I look amazing every time I wear this. And I get compliments every time I wear this. So that's another thing I love about this foundation is the simple fact that it gives you a natural, beautiful look. You will look like you do not have makeup on. But you will look like you have perfect skin and most people don't have perfect skin so <laughs> with that being said people probably will know you have makeup on but you won't get that cakey over the top i have makeup on look you will get that natural beautiful look if you have normal to dry skin or combination to oily skin i think you all should just go out get a sample give it a try i think this is one of the best foundations that lancome has come up with and it is definitely worth the money okay guys so i hope you guys enjoyed my review like i said before i think this foundation is great for 
everyone, all skin types. I think it is wonderful. Like I said before, after you watch this video, go out and go get you a sample. Try it out if you don't have it. And I'm telling you, you guys will love it. All right, until next time.